Hi everyone, I'm Kralis and welcome back to episode 8 in Possible. Why is that what was that garbage truck doing? Just died it, just like that. But anyhow, welcome back to possibly the slowest let's play of this Galaxy 2 on YouTube. So just sit back, relax, and enjoy. And if you do, as always, leave some feedback in the comment section and do hit the like button. But ladies and gentlemen, we might have a titty, titty, a slight traffic situation in the city. But we're not gonna fix that. Mm -mm. Once we are done with this, we're just gonna send this map to Bifa over on YouTube and he's gonna fix it for us. Genius. No, I'm just joking. We're gonna fix this ourselves or maybe not, who knows? It's still this little like uh, roundabout uh, crossing section. I even tweaked the street to one of those streets. And if, the thing is that there's still like random cars coming through here. Like not only like service vehicles, just random cars. But I'm not sure why they are stopping here. Like, look at that. What does that sign say, dude? What? Lady? Stuff like this. Like this lady. She thinks she owns this intersection. Sometimes this works flawlessly. And sometimes there are people jaywalking all over the place. There's cars doing random turns all over the place. Might be depending on when people go and come home from work and such. You kind of need, like, I don't want to do this because that's going to obviously hinder the traffic, but will this help us doing this? And maybe even changing the road to one of those divided ones. That might prevent cars from doing, like, super random U-turns uh, everywhere. <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> no, 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 they're just getting updated. Because I just fixed the road, or changed the road, I guess. But there's nobody doing, doing uh, jaywalking anymore. So I guess that's always something. But I'm not changing this. I love this bandature. And this kind of going in. So, so for the moment, I'm going to keep it. But also, in the previous episode, we've built the university. And this is something you guys were quite happy and thrilled about because we have been slacking education from pretty much day one. Now we have 891 people attending our beautiful university in Keralesville. I'm kind of thinking, that, can you see if that's people only from our city? Because I don't want to have people from outside. Because I don't think I can afford more education for the moment. Because look at this. Elementary school. We have 5,270 eligible. They're like they're reproducing like Irish over here. Like I love Irish, okay? My wife is Irish. But but, but making babies is like a pastime over there. Uh, high school. High school is almost on the verge of non-existent. College. We need one more college. <laughs> Even university, man. And it's not cheap. Like this guy over here, 335k. An elementary school, 35. Okay, that's not that bad, I guess. Kind of forgot to upgrade this guy. Look at this. That is a little bit of extra space and even a library. This is not bad. I was so afraid when I first started playing this game that uh, like all the bushes and trees weren't going to grow up on all the things we were pooping down. But they do. And it just looks so... And also lush and pretty. Look at all the people over here. And how is the upkeep on this guy? The upkeep is 100k. And how about our collage, which is just over here? I believe that is kind of filled up to the brim. Ooh, pretty much 255k. We need we need more education. But 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 not today. Oh, by the way, this is something added in between episodes as well. Upon request from you guys, like previously we had a, this main road and then the key and the river and now we have like a beautiful pedestrian path all along the river for those romantic walks and strolls in the moonlight maybe this is where all the baby making happens i don't know but I, like i believe like once the trees grow up i think you guys let me know i think it might look really nice over here and oh my goodness what has happened in the parks over here those are like uh like 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 debris or maybe homeless people oh no how about the rest of the parks over here? That's a beautiful house over here. Uh, how about the swimming pool? Nothing, nothing over here. And tennis courts? <sighs> this is bad. This is bad. We might need a, like, a welfare office. I want to be the good guy. But it does cost one point. So the welfare office provides financial support for the low-income citizens which increases their well-being and lowers the likelihood of reoccurring crime. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. And uh, let's see here, how big is this guy? Well, it's, that's a stupid question, it's gonna be huge. Uh, yeah, <laughs> pretty much so. 
<laughs> okay, so let's just think about this. How is the range on this? If I would pop down one over here, somewhere about, maybe here, and then maybe one here, still gonna, well, that's it's gonna still leave this spot. And I'm not sure about the upkeep, or well, 45k for upkeep, so that's not that terrible. So let's maybe add one over here in the, in the polluted area. Terrible, terrible Kiraz. Let's do it here. Perfect. And let's take a peek at this. Any upgrades? Nope. So 45k, efficiency 100%, 12 employees, maybe assigned to districts would be a thing. But let's add... Hmm. This is just temporarily. I don't want to destroy our beautiful paths over here. No, no, no. Let's get one guy situated somewhere here in the far end. And should we really be the super good guys that have one more here? That's going to cover the whole city with Bell B. However, like, it is not bad, as you can see. Just by having those two and this one over here, so I guess that uses the outer road over here, so we should be fine. Let's not waste any more cash for the moment. But hopefully, well, you know what? I mean, maybe that is not the welfare centers they need. Maybe it's just low-income low housing. How about the rest? Like, is there any people over here in the American Egg Ball Stadium? Nope. Nothing over here. How about those over here? Yep. <laughs> There's their stands build up. Maybe there is stuff over here. Okay, now I feel bad. There is, like, Egg Ball Stadium is filled with those guys. How about the football stadium? They're, they're invading the pitch. Okay, I think... I'm not sure how we're going to solve this, because I've never seen that. I don't think that was in CDS1 whatsoever. Maybe... Okay, so this guy's still complaining. Hopefully not for long. I'm not terrible. You guys might be terrible, but I'm going to put down just a few extra ones just over here for the moment. Just so we get some extra people in, and everybody's going to be super happy. Is that the one we need? Yep. Is, is there a difference between the American and the European one? Well, it's got to be. Don't do it, Kiraz. Could be pollution over here. Hey, it is what it is. We need those. And hands down, I'm not gonna be the guy, but but I kind of love those uh, those uh, low income apartments. They're just the perfect size, especially like for, for this area over here. Maybe just a tiny one over here. Like zone out this, and maybe one a little bit fatter. Anybody moving in? Well, I guess not. Those guys are moving in. We'll see what happens. Maybe that makes them disappear. Because I know those guys are complaining about, you know, uh, about high rent and such. So maybe those guys have moved out and moved in here. Who knows? But also, what I want to have here is that I've seen, well, maybe not now, but I've seen a lot of dead people. And I don't want to see dead people. So let's maybe add one more crematorium. Because that is kind of pretty much the highway right into the city, into the roundabout, and then even past the hospital, which is perfect for us. We can pick up dead people over there. So let's see here. Where, where, where was this? Over here. Let's get this guy. And let's maybe even add, uh, shall we? Yes. Additional incinerator. So we can burn people twice as fast if you wanted. Two parking garages. And maybe this little brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Oh, also in between episodes, I bought a few extra tiles and expanded the highway all the way to the neighboring city. It's not a perfect highway, and I think once we reach this area, we will tweak it quite drastically. Because the landscape here, it's, it's a little bit tricky to work with, because it is like a huge valley, and it's very steep, as you can see over here on the highway. So, like for the moment, this is what we got, and, and it works. But this doesn't, what you guys need? High resource cost, high resource cost, high, high resource cost. And you need... Rock. Well, you don't rock. Rocks. Rocks. Well, I guess that is fairly cheap to acquire. Like the rocks, because you don't need like a like a like a natural resource spot for those guys. You just put them down wherever you kinda kinda want, right? But but I'm not there yet. Well I am kinda, but this is what I mean. I should be spending time. But I'm like, yeah, manana manana. We're gonna fix that another day. Um so we're producing crude oil, we're exporting crude oil, we are producing a little bit of metal ore and coal. But we need wood, grain, livestock, vegetables, cotton. We need rock and a bunch of other stuff as well. But I'm not in a hurry. That's the thing. I'm really not in a hurry. So let's just wait. Let's just wait how we're looking at money. We are making a surplus of 300k. How did that happen? Nobody knows, but it happened. By the way, is this emptying? Yes, it is. How about this guy over here? Still have some space, you know, and we could maybe... Get one of those extra furnaces, so we're making some extra money now, and even a storage extension on this guy. Can I squeeze that? Yes, I can. Can I do more? Don't do more! What is that? Garage track depot? How many vehicles are being used? <laughs> one out of 20. No, no, no. Let's, let's wait with that, I guess. But you know what I want to do today? Is that rocks? Rocks? rocks so i was thinking about making a harbor even though we have issues which we could attend to over here like build like a like an ore depot over here or like a like a stone rock thingy majiggy but i'm not gonna do that because it's a beautiful forest i was thinking about making a harbor and i've been looking at this area and as i said just a second ago like the worst enemy in this region is the landscape because even though this is very flat like, a, you can't even see my city from here because there's a big mountain and such. And it's it's not ideal. It's not great by any means. So I've been thinking, like, this side of the map is super flat. But I don't, I don't care about that at the moment either. I want to have a harbor here in the future. But I also want to have... What, what's this happening over here? What is the... Did I just see a heart? I see a heart. Is this where the Irish people are? Making babies. What is happening in, in Fatty Bite of all places? Don't you have any shame? Okay, I'm, I'm a little bit intrigued. <laughs> so am I? What is a baby making in Fatty Bite? What is this? What is, what is, what is happening? It requires food, yeah. It sells meals, yeah, we love them. But what is this heart? Like, it, it comes, comes again. It, many hearts. I feel like a peeping tom over here, but I but but what is happening? Fatty bites? Is something here in the backstage of fatty? Oop, something happened. Nope, that was just somebody walking in. Like I don't know. <laughs> like if anybody knows what this is all about, they might just be really loving fatty bites. And hearts are gone, just like that. Okay, I'm gonna be standing here watching you guys. How's the situation on the streets? It's quite busy, I gotta say. But the thing I wanted to do today was building a harbor. Like, I really want to have a harbor, because seeing the ships and such is just magical. However, I will wait with that for at least one more episode. But I'm going to landscape this whole region. Like, from about here, maybe, I'm going to drop it down and make this a huge harbor of some type. So we're going to pretty much elevate this or remove this whole land piece make some beautiful elevations and such and make it pretty but the thing i hate about the, this area is how the river it, it's super high up here and then it just drops into this like well obviously it's going downstreams and everything and all but i don't think it's going to look great with having a harbor and then having the river floating so i have been thinking okay and this is just this is this might be very bad i'm going to save the game in case this goes down south very fast i want to have geothermal corrales no I want to have a hydro dam. I want to have my hydro. I've been using that in CCS1 and might have not been super successful, but I want to give this a go. 
I want to have a hydroelectric power plant somewhere over here. Like here, in this, in this vicinity. So, let's do this. Let's buy some tiles. And not with that button, Kiralis. With this button. Let's buy maybe all those. Just so we get a nice shape over here. Purchase. Please do. We're making money still, so don't worry about that. And then... No, and then... Oh yes, let's say I'm gonna just save my game quickly. Game saved, and we have the hydroelectric power plants. Like I know, like it would be easier just getting this guy and poop down, and yay, we've got it. But this this takes this takes a little bit of of finesse to master. And I'm not saying I have mastered it, but hopefully we will. So how does that even go about? I guess elevation is too low. Okay, so we're gonna have the harbor somewhere just here, right? So if we put it over here, that should give us plenty of space before the harbor. <laughs> this, is gonna, this is gonna fail so ter terribly. But uh, let's see. Let's go elevation-wise. What elevation do we pick? We could maybe go like this elevation, but then, I mean, that's kind of close to the city elevation. Girls. Hey, hey, hey. Nobody has died in my hands yet. <laughs> But they will now. I guess I'm going to do quite a bit of this on camera. Because this might fail. It might be a little bit funny. Can I poop it down over here now? How about no? Elevation too low. Okay. Let's see. If I would pick maybe this elevation over here. I would go in here. And I would do this. And then maybe take it in a little bit. This is this is this is just for testing purposes, ladies and gentlemen. This is nothing we, we will keep, or well, we will hopefully will keep it. But this over here is nothing we will keep. Okay, so that could work. That would produce, in best case scenario, eleven hundred megawatts. What what? Eleven hundred megawatts. Let me just see here. If I get a nice shape of this, you might be, but what is he doing? I'm making rods. I was born to do this, okay? Le leave me be. Okay, I don't think this is going to work out. But hopefully it will. If I take it in even further, will that give us the, 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 the situation we want to have? Let's see. This is over here. Let's go over here. So that goes from this side to that side. 1200 megawatts at the best case scenario. 1200 ladies and gentlemen can i do more okay 1200 i'm happy with 1200 i guess okay we might tweak this is this place correctly i don't know oh, no, no. huge city even milestone and then let's see here i make this mega bigger mega mega no not that big too big too big too big and then i'm so afraid we're gonna flood the whole area but we have a backup save okay so no harm to be done, or no harm has been done. So we know the elevation of the dam should be over here, right? As I as I see it, because I think if if this is placed correctly, which I don't, I'm not really sure it is, but I think it is, because that should be on this side, that should be on this side. That means those holes over here, camera, camera, those holes over here will be flooded. So at least to that like to, to that dark gray meets the white gray line, there would be water or will be water. Let's give this let's give this a go. If it fails, it fails. If it succeeds, it's gonna be a like yay, everybody happy and we're making big bucks and we don't have to worry about money ever 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 again. Well, we will. Okay, I'm just don't don't hey hey hey. I know I know this is judgmental from your side, okay? But this is free landscaping. And we can do this. Let me just pick this elevation. Let's go like this to get nice shapes going over here. So that would be going like that. Maybe we take that further in. Like so. And then we're going to shape it out. Make it really pretty. All the trees need to be gone, gone as well. I'm so hoping this is going to work. I would be so happy if it did. And maybe take me. I kind of want to have this even further in. How is that elevation over here? Like, that's it. Okay, so that does, doesn't really... Hmm, that doesn't interfere at all. Well, it kind of does, but it's not going to really drench the whole thing. And hopefully what this 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 won't do is drain all the water from, from this area. Like, so far... 
it's kind of looking decent over here. Like, I don't want to do this nicely and then this doesn't work and everything is really, really messed up and bad. And how power situation, we can connect it from this side, right? So let's just drop it by maybe 30 meters. That is going to be following this shape. It's going to go into a little transformer, which is situated just over here. I guess that is the closest one we've got. Or maybe even the only one we've got. Yeah. So that goes in here and then transforms the high voltage coming from the power hydro power plant. And that becomes low voltage current usable by buildings. Great success. <laughs> Not really yet. Hey, should we have it curved? Nah, 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 I don't care about that. I don't think it, I don't think it matters that much if you have it curved or not. Like in real life, both exist, right? We have both those like bendy ones and, and straight ones. I think the deeper this is on this side, the better it's gonna get when it comes to power production, right? At least CS1 had that, but but it's been so many years since I played that, so I'm not I'm not sure at all. So that would be the the deepest points, the deepest drop. I'm gonna be going a little bit on this side as well. I'm gonna smoothen this out and make this pretty. No, we're not. Yes, we will. You just believe in this. Like that, that comes in. Hmm. Also, you know what we could do? So this is going to take a while until that fills up and we can start shaping that out. But this is something we could have done. Because we could have been doing like nice shapes with this, shaping this out, dragging that all. So let's say we would have those streets, like those pedestrian streets. We don't have to have those. We could pretty much have alleys. But I do like, like the, the, the design of them. I don't know, they just look nice. They have those beautiful lights and such. I don't think this has any, has it? Oh, well, it does have. Hey, let's start with the big one and then we can change to the smaller ones in case we kind of like them better. But the idea here is... We pick and make a little key. Then we can have keys going all the way from here. All the way throughout... Singing in progress with Corrales. Welcome, everybody. Go to maybe like 2.5, maybe 3.75. Okay, it becomes a key with that, which is not terrible, which is not terrible at all. I like those walls quite a bit. That is something we could have done. We're getting a key straight off from this over here. Both kind of work, I guess. Girls, what is happening? Nobody knows. Nobody knows yet. I'm waiting for this water to fill up, which is gradually doing. It's going to take quite a bit of time until it does that. But I want to I wanna make this a thing. I mean, how are we looking on this? I think that should be fairly nice. That would go all the way here. It could connect to this bridge in the far end later on. I can hear a helipopper. Oh, did I stop it. It's, okay. okay. Oh, you know, we just added the police popper in the previous episode. I haven't seen it yet. Not in today's episode, that is. It's inspecting the dam. It's uh, making a judgment if this is going to fail or not, and <laughs> it definitely will. Look at those guys. Look at them. They're, afraid they're like mountain goats or something. Why do I always play games like an idiot? Like, why do I always make stuff hard when it can be so easy and enjoyable? Don't get me wrong, this is kind of enjoyable, but it's, it's, it's definitely making it trickier than it should have been. This is not going to work out. Well, it will, but we need to move it. Because the whole like idea was to have this, this little like um, canal centered on the whole dam itself. And now, as you can see, it's not, not, not so great. I mean, like... I have, uh, we will see, we'll see. Let's make this bigger. It, it's not bad, it's not bad, but it's still like coming from this angle, it's gonna look a little bit wonky because there's a road going. Like for the pedestrians, if anybody's gonna be using this in the future, the view would be magical and breathtaking. But uh, yeah, we need to move that. I think if we make it like this side would be perfect. This side is amazing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let me, let me just fig figure out this out. And I'm going to bring you guys back in. And hopefully this dam will be working in today's episode. Because that would mean that I could landscape this whole region. And next episode we can start a harbor of some type. 
that would be kind of exciting, right? Is anybody dying in the city, by the way? We've been playing with speed up and, and oh, they're back. Oh, by the way, what happened to the tennis guys? Oh, no. It's a crime scene now. How do we prevent this? It kind of feels like I've done it. We have the welfare offices. I'm being a good person. But for some reason, it's not helping. Efficiency, 118. Those guys... Okay, you guys... <gasps> Sweet faces. It seems that we can zone this out because the pollution seems to be gone. Kiraz, you're building a dam. Yeah, 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 yeah. I am, I am. Okay, I'm, I'm not happy. You guys are happy. Well, I'm not kind of happy because now we can make this area pretty. That's something we're going to do. But but yes, as I said, let me just figure this out. It is not perfect, but it's damn much better. This, no bueno. I think it is the road which is interfering with this whole damn project or the building itself. But other than that, I know, yeah, like this over here. I'm not sure why it does that. Like as soon as you zoom out a little bit, it kind of glitches up. If you guys got that in your gameplay, please let me know because I might have done something, something wrong here. But other than that... We have a little canal, which goes all the way here. It's going to be continuing a little bit. There's going to be a road going all the way from here to about here. And this whole area is going to be drenched. We will have a beautiful harbor here <laughs> one day. Hopefully the next episode. We'll see, all right? But man. Um, oh, okay. That is something which I haven't really checked. Is this a thing? Can I? Oh, I can. Okay, so I, I can't make a secret connection with the outside world. I was like, have I picked a map and this is not possible? It would be so, so sad because the ships are amazing. But it seems to be working as intended. So that is perfect. And what goes for, for the dam itself, currently we are producing 1,131 megawatts. This is fluctuating up and down a little bit. Uh, I guess we can maybe even dig this deeper. And this needs to be landscaped nicely, and it is. But this is so much power. Like, okay, look at this. So we're currently using, uh, like the whole city is using 101 megawatts. We are producing 1,300. We are exporting almost 500 out of that. And money-wise, in a surplus by $1.8 million. Electricity exports 1.2. So it might not be in the most profitable, but this building itself, it has an upkeep of 100k only. That is super cheap. Until something goes south if everybody dies. But, but 100k, so, so cheap. And I'm loving this. That kind of, kind of means that we can... What is happening up here? No pedestrian access, I think it is. Interesting. Can I see a lot of pedestrian access in your building? But let's demolish that guy. And that means we could... Pause this, because if something goes south, I want to have them as a backup. So in case I have low money, they will be here. And then we can turn this off over here. Don't have to, because this is green power. But I mean, I'm not paying 25k. 25 k for an idle one. That's something I can live with, I guess. Anything else we need to turn off which produces power? I guess this guy, but then again, he's burning the trash. He's making 77 7 megawatts as well. That is impressive. And how are we doing now? So production 1300. Selling still quite a bit. And still making tons of cash. I could not be happier. But yeah, we need to landscape this. Make this nicer. There's going to be a highway going. Well, somewhere. I'm not really sure where to put it now. And also by having this. It's not as eyesorey as having uh, the river going downstreams and then a huge harbor because that wouldn't make any sense this breaks it off very nicely oh i can't wait i can't wait to start a harbor but that is not gonna be today now we're gonna play some housing finally so what do we want to have uh, we have demand for pretty much everything i'm still thinking about the skyline itself i like those buildings they're just perfectly sized then we have a little bit bigger a little bit bigger then a little bit bigger so i guess here we would be having hmm interesting maybe maybe the medium density parking lot will be situated over here they will be using it because you can see their, their buildings over here filled with cars and even the streets are filled with cars so that is the low rent. So let me just add a few extra. 
just over here. I'm so happy that people are actually building up now. I was a little bit afraid that, that this pollution will never go away. Add in a medium housing. So I guess more of those. This is like a like I, I like this whole idea of of uh, zoning out different different sizes. It is, however, a little bit tedious doing as well. But 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 I like the idea. How are we doing on a dam? Twelve hundred thirty. So doing it a little bit deeper did the trick. That is a fantastic output. Look at my cash. I've never been this rich. I like this. Like there's a little bit of bigger buildings mixed in with the, like the, the lower residential and the row houses and such. But nah, I'm a big fan. Question if we should have like mm, it's it's tricky because I want to have like more lower residential, but maybe we should wait with them, move them a little bit further away or something. Yeah, that, that, I think that is the way to go. So we will have row houses situated like so, all the way to about here. Because why not? And then have a little mix, mixed buildings. We could have the low rent housing over here. I might, might, might lower the land values a little bit. I mean, hands down. This is going to take a while because this is going to be a lot of shaping, removing, adding and so on and so on. But I'm absolutely loving this. So this, as I said, like this makes perfect sense having a little bit bigger buildings because we got the university, we got the train tracks, we got all the shoppies over here. The police headquarters, obviously. And then we just go higher and higher up. Yeah, this is going to take a while to tweak, to tweak. But I'm so happy with it. Progress is being made. Ooh, it's a fire. The roof. Okay, those guys are complaining again. No, nah, everything is fine. Nobody died. And let me see the dam. Please, please make some. 12.30. Still. Okay, so, so that did the trick. And yeah, we need to move the... Move, need to move this. We need a wastewater treatment facility somewhere about. I guess there's going to be downstreams. And cash-wise... I'm making 2.5 million bucks. For what? By the way, let me just see the public transportation. Let me just stand over here and public transportation. How are we doing on buses? Have gone up through the roof. Maybe not six and seven, but that is the ones over in the industrial area. Train wise, I mean, it's not terrible. 800 people on that one. Cargo ones, eh. but, uh, but this is great. This is great. We need more buses. We need more bus routes. And how is the bus situation? 47 out of 55. So we are on the verge. We need more. We need to move that. How about the trains though? 13 out of 15. Which means I need one more of those. We could do it. I'm getting rich. So that is a maintenance hall. I love all the models. This is perfect. Like if you if, like if you love stuff like this, this is so so nice to, to look at. Like especially transportation and trains. I uh, love it, love it to bits. But the most important project for today's episode was the dam, and it is damn nice. It is working at least, and that makes me happy. We're making bank two point eight million. It's not it's not a lot, but for being me. That is, that's quite a bit. So yeah, we're going to be tweaking this in the next episode once we reach the harbor region. More bushes and trees on the sides. This is going to be landscape even further. And this over here. Oh, you know what I could do? Let me see here. Because I do see there's a little bit of ambulance issues. I haven't really upgraded our, our, what you can call it, our hospital that much. So we could add a helipad, which is going to be super useful for me to look at. Because helipoppers, more helipoppers is amazing. A specialized treatment ward. Now we can afford that. So let's do that for the people. And also a trauma center. Yes. Who's who's the good mayor? Well, obviously me. And hopefully everybody's going to be loving that. It's getting a little bit framey in downtown. And okay, you know what I need to look at? How's the train station scenario in this episode? Do we have any people over here? Ah, decent amount, I guess so nice so nice but yeah like landscaping this with more bushes 
Ooh, there's gonna be a big boy over here. But it's so buzzing and so vibrant. Yeah, I got a big smile. I, I like this. Especially like when we have the dam and we're working, finally making money. That makes me super happy. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna, gonna tweak this area a little bit. But I do like the skyline from it. I, I absolutely adore and love that. Might not be a big fan of the layout when it comes to like the row houses and such. But we're gonna figure that out. Thank you so much for watching today's episode. I'm gonna see you guys in the next episode of City Skylines with Mikrells, where we're gonna tackle hopefully the harbor region and continue the dam. But it's working. I'm not gonna check how we're making because you know it fluctuates quite a bit. 608. I speed this up and it's gonna be like 1200 again. But uh, nevertheless, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so, so, so much for watching. Adoring this. Absolutely loving this part.